Ah, there we go. Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, Anthony here. Uh, also known as Abwell. Uh, I voted. Let me see if I could like flip that around. Uh, cat freaking out. I don't know. Um. Uh, yeah, anyways, yeah, I went and voted, um, today, uh, here in Texas, let's see, it's, um, uh, October 24th, uh, right now it's 9.39 a.m., I just got home, but yeah, um, I worked night shift, uh, boss man wanted me to come in at 11, work 11 to 8, uh, well, my department manager anyways, uh, I decided, uh, well, I was feeling pretty tired, and uh, I didn't really feel like getting out of bed, and I didn't really have to be there till 12, which is midnight last night, so I decided to go in at 12 instead, and then I was work till about 8. He wanted me to uh, ask Cindy, the current like super, uh, store manager, like the super big boss of the store, about a um, promotion to full-time, like actual full-time promotion. Which I'm already working like full time hours basically, but technically I'm considered like part time, and it's less like less money per hour, you know. But if I got promoted to actual full time, full time, it would also be a little bit more money. Plus, you know, it would also be a little bit more hours. But I'm already getting like full time hours sometimes overtime anyways. But it would be more like guaranteed scheduled of 40 hours every week than you know the lighter schedule that I normally get but yeah after that uh got off i didn't really see or anything and i don't know i've only been working there for three months now yeah this would be my third month i think the, i think today i think the, either today or the 27th I'm trying to think, well, does I start the 24th or 27th? Either today or pretty soon, it'd be my third month anniversary of working there. It's probably why he was like, oh, ask him to send me about promotion to full time. Because I've already been working like over 40 hours every week, anyways. Since I've been there and it's been over like uh, 90 days now. Yeah, 90 days is probably why, uh, why he was asking me. But yeah, I did that, and then I forgot off. I went over there, uh, downtown Conroe, uh, Lee G. Wentworth building, or something like that, and uh, went ahead and cast my ballot. Filled out the thing. It's pretty easy, man. Voting was real easy. And despite the line, everybody's going in and out real quick. You know, it didn't take very long. Uh, just took a minute, you know, he had, to, he had to find a place to park, uh, like across the street at the church or whatever. You know, there's, there's plenty of places kind of like find some place to kind of like park your car or your bike or whatever and then just walk on over there. It ain't that far, you know, it's pretty easy and stuff like that. And uh, when it voted and all that stuff, uh, some old man uh, gave me, uh, well, he was handing these out. I know, uh, I don't know how to flip this. Uh, thing around where you could actually read it. Uh, but it says Linda Linda Good Lone Star College District 7. Because it wasn't, I mean, it wasn't just for the general election for the president and stuff, it was also for um, city count, uh, senators, U.S. representatives, um, judges, uh, sheriffs, um, um, you know, people for the school districts and stuff, and, uh, you know, this is for the college. And then there was some stuff optional. I didn't, I didn't really have to actually vote for it. It's optional, but I went in anyways, you know. I'd rather just go ahead and, you know, vote for, you know, one person. Even if there's, like, only one guy running and he's uncontested, I'm still going to put put him on there. Um, uh, I think this year is my first year of actually voting both in the uh, primaries and the um, the regular. Uh, Become more an actual active voter. I'm 28 years old. Uh, 10 years of not really voting, except once. I think I voted once when I was 18. I think I did. 
Yeah, I think yeah, I think I voted that time. Then the rest of the time, um, I'll be registered or unregistered or whatever. I'll I'll be registered, but uh, I didn't actually go out like vote like when Obama was running and all that stuff and all that stuff, all that good jazz was going on. I I didn't go out and vote for anybody or anything. But uh, this year I am. This year getting all up into it a little bit. It's pretty good, pretty fun, you know. Well, all, that, all that good stuff. Uh, what else is going on? Work's been going good. Uh, I was pretty tired today. I didn't really want to work. I wanted to leave early, but I stayed and finished my job and stuff. Uh, I got some beer, man. Uh, I went to my girlfriend's Kroger after I got done uh, voting. Well, they hung out for a few minutes and uh, got some Lone Star beer. Uh, I was thinking about getting some bush or whatever. They had some special, some things for with the shop with the Kroger Shopper card. It was like six dollars each or five dollars each for a six pack or whatever. Depends on the brand. And she's sick with some kind of cold and stuff and like mucus, like super cough. So she don't like regular like orange juice. I got some Sunny D. It has vitamin C in it and all that good stuff. I mean, of course, you know, it's not that healthy because it's also got like tons of sugar and stuff in it but if she'll drink it you know get some of that well let's see in there that'd be fun uh all that stuff got some Kroger waters I mean I got like ground water but um you yeah, know that's fun everything else has been going pretty good man everything's been going great just been taking it easy Sometimes, man, the night shift, it just kind of gets to me, dude. It's like, man, I just feel tired, like I'm drained or super sleepy. Or sometimes I'm just like, I feel sore, you know. Lately, like past couple of days, two or three days, I feel like just sore. Like, just like, I mean, I can lift everything. I'm pretty strong. I just ain't got that, like, urge, like, just to open boxes really fast and, like, Mm, I mean, I still open on fat. I mean, even when I'm technically, according to the boss and everybody, I admit when I'm slow and I feel slow. I feel like I'm going slow. You know, to me, I, I'm going like slow motion. Like like last night, I'm going slow motion. But even though I, to me, I am going slow, to everybody else, I'm still going way faster than they are. So that's. It's kind of hilarious to me because, I mean, well, I guess, yeah, because I try to finish, like, say, we're conditioning, right? You know, where you got to, you know, move the product up against the shelf and line it up and line the products up. I got to put at least at least two up, you know, uh, you know, like two products up front and then two behind it and stuff like that. I'll fly in through, like, a whole, like, aisle, like, whole side of an aisle, um, like, ten minutes. And they're over there on like one or two sections, and it's taking them like the amount of time it takes them to do like those two sections. I'm already like done, and I'm like, man, I'm going like this is slow motion to me, you know. Boss master trying to say like I'm super fast or something, you know. I was like, man, uh, this is this is slow motion because I feel tired, and I could feel myself kind of like I'm still going kind of fast, but I could go faster than that. You know, I could actually get up, move, squat, and do things, you know, a lot faster. Um, there's, there's slow, well, see, I got, I got my super fast, my fast, my normal speed. I got my slow speed, and I got my super slow speed. And apparently, even, even with me going super slow, I'm still faster than, like, half the night crew. So, that's fine. That's just in days where I'm just like, uh, yeah. <laughs> the, that's probably why I feel so tired. Maybe that's why I'm so sore, because normally I'm going, like, super fast, or whatever, however you want to say it. Normally I work hard, super fast, and I don't know. After doing that for a while, like, so many days straight, there were there were a few days like last week where I like basically killed myself going like extra turbo speed like 
killing myself trying to uh, bust ass and get some shit done. So I could like fix the, I had a lot of work I needed it done and I worked extra fast to get it all done. And um, it kind of wore me out. <laughs> so ever since then, uh, now that I don't have to actually work as hard, because I've got everything kind of like set where I don't have to work too hard, now I'm just like extra tired and I don't want to really do much. But I still do quite a bit. But, um, yeah, the boss man, uh, part manager says he thinks I'm the only guy that actually, like, deserves full-time promotion or whatever. I mean, other people could apply for it, too, because it's mostly by seniority, but, um, it's more like you have to actually earn it. I mean, it's not all seniority. I mean, because there's some people that have been there, you know, longer than I have, you know, over a year and stuff. But, uh, I've only been there maybe, like, three months, and... I'm like whooping everybody's ass over there, pretty much. In some ways, I'm even faster and more efficient than the department manager himself, actually. So, I mean, you know, a lot of things he kind of like likes to put off or, you know, but... I could still knock out a lot of stuff. I could even, like, scan things faster than he can. You know, so if we gotta, like, shoot something and check the balance, you know, like, the inventory of what's on hand, I'm pretty, like, quick about counting. I mean, it's not, I don't know, math, math is pretty easy for me. Um, yeah, I can pretty much just look at the product, and, uh, you know, the, the gun will tell you how much, how much goes on the shelf or how much locations we have. Okay, well, if all those are full... Okay, and then it says you got less than that, but you also got back stock of like so many cases. I mean, it don't, it don't, it don't take, it don't take me like fucking two seconds to like count it and you know fix it. So it's pretty good. Um, I'm kind of rambling on here a little bit. Sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, I just figured I'd make a little quick video here, uh, a little bit of an update. I don't, I don't really do a lot of videos anymore or lately I was doing I, I, I try to like do a few and then I just kind of like uh, and I quit doing them and then I do some and I quit doing them I just I kind of do them whenever I'm in the mood to do them or if there's something like really special to talk about or um, you know it's on my mind a lot of times when I get off work I'm like tired I don't even feel like doing it I just pull up the Netflix or whatever I lay down which is probably what I'm going to do here in a minute. I'm planning on um, probably laying down, probably watch some YouTube, um, probably uh, watch some Netflix, probably drink some beer. Um, might, uh, I don't know what I'm going to eat today. Uh, I was going to get some stuff, but I checked my balance. I only like 20 bucks, so I got some beer and some, you know, a couple of things. Like nine bucks or whatever. Probably try to try to make it last till Thursday. It is Monday, uh, Tuesday. I'm off. I'm off tomorrow. Tomorrow night, Tuesday, and uh, I'm off thurs Thursday night. But gotta work tonight again at midnight, and then I gotta work again. Uh. Ah, uh, whoops. <clears throat> gotta work again. Uh, tonight, midnight, and Wednesday night, midnight. But yeah, um, I think I've kind of like let this uh, ramble on along. Uh, I hope you like that skin. Yeah, a little bit of a uh, skin. I meant to just take off the one shirt. I, w I was thinking about editing that out, but uh, I'll just leave it so you can enjoy it. <laughs> Oh, baby, you already know. But, yeah. Uh, after that, I'll probably go to sleep soon. Try to get some kind of nap. See, yeah, the girlfriend works today till 3.30. No, 3. Today's Monday. 7.30 to 3. Oh, the mailman keeps getting stuck. 
whoever delivers my mail. And at least twice, the, the, the actual like mail truck, the USPS truck, had to get towed. Because right over here, there's no shoulder. There's no shoulder. Even even the road has like a little line, and you can see there's no shoulder. But he still kind of like goes too close to the edge there. Somehow or another, I guess he can't determine distance. I'm not quite sure why, but he does it anyways. And there's like a hole where like where when it rained and we had all that flooding. I think I got some old videos of some of it. I don't know if they're still up there or not. If I deleted them. But uh, there was like a lot of flooding and I washed out a lot of the road and uh, the ditches and stuff. But, um, yeah, um, anyways, it kind of washed out all the dirt there next to the next to the uh, road right there, like a big old hole. For some reason, it keeps falling into it. So uh, I had a couple old uh, buckets. I just went over there. I put the buckets just now in the um in the hole so hopefully he can see it oh hey there's a bucket there oh yeah there's a hole there yeah it's like duh don't don't get stuck sir do not get stuck because it will be a bad bad day if you get stuck but yeah other than that that is about it um i think that was this video and long long enough it's like 60 minutes I don't know when the next one will be. I don't know, but I do know if you are registered to vote, or if you're able, if if you haven't and you're able to register, go ahead and register. If you're already registered, just go out and vote. I don't I don't care who you vote for. Republican, Democrat, Libertarian, Green Party, whatever. Just just go out, pick somebody. Pick, just pick somebody, you know. Even, you know, I don't care what your views are. You know, whether you like one guy or hate the other one or hate them both. Just, just go out and pick, pick, pick somebody. You know, because whoever, you, you know, whoever you pick, that, you know, that person, whoever wins is going to end up representing, you know, your, your, your city, your country, your state, all that stuff. Um. So just go out and uh, put it in. You know, I'm pretty sure you can like Google like some information about certain people, you know, and and their views and um, their legislation and you know what they plan on doing uh, in the office or whatever, you know, and what kind of rights they support and things that they you know may try to change or whatever. And if uh, you know they kind of fits your fancy or float your boat, um, go with them, you know, or, you know, go with your gut instinct, whatever you think, just go for it, man, uh, despite all the, uh, BS you may see on TV and all that good stuff, just, uh, just do it, man, just go out and do it, uh, it's not hard, it's not hard at all, just, uh, just go out and do it. That, that's one thing, man. I think like a lot, most of the, most Americans don't even vote at all, and then they sit there and bitch about who who ends up elected. It's like, well, you know, go out and do it. You know, go out and do it. Whether the person you want wins or loses, it doesn't matter. Just just put it in, and you know, just put it in. Just do it. Yeah. It's a good thing. You know. It's one of your rights and one of your freedoms to uh, to decide, you know. You got decisions. Decisions need to be made. You know. So just go out and do it. Just do it. That's all I can say. Just do it. Just get her done. Do it, get her done. You know, I don't, I don't care. I don't care what you think or, or whatever, just what your opinions are. Um, I might share my opinions after the, after the elections and stuff uh, and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, just go out and do it, man. Just go out and get her done. You know, if you want to do it early or do it on time, whatever, whatever convenience it is for you, just make sure you do it and get her done.
Just do it. Just do it. All right, guys. 20 minute video. Uh, this is Zab. I'm gonna take off here and uh, go relax and stuff. And uh, I will talk to you all later. Maybe next week. I don't know. I guess for right now, I guess it would be kind of considered weekly video videos. I don't know. Uh, but the channel isn't isn't dead. It's just kind of like temporary hiatus. Let's put it that way. The channel is a temporary hiatus till uh till uh you know I get get things kind of situated where I do them more often. But good news is the the channel actually hit the ten dollar mark on YouTube. Uh, I know it ain't real like anything big, so which. It ain't anyways. This is just something I'm just doing for fun. I haven't really been doing it like very seriously or putting much effort at all into videos. I just do it socially and for, for fun, mostly. So uh, I might, you know, start making some more legit videos. Most, most of this is just me. Me just being me, doing me. Uh, very little editing or anything. Just kind of like uncut. Just as is you know mostly so anyways with that being said if you made it to this part of the video thank you thank you very much uh, if y'all got time you know the like button uh, share with your friends you know what i'm saying brothers you know kind of help boost boost these videos up a little bit hope you enjoyed it if you got anything to tell me or you want to talk about something got a question there is a uh, comment box down there so if you're, you know, if you got a Google account and you're signed in with uh, YouTube and all that, you can, uh, you know, leave me a comment or whatever, um, stuff like that. I might leave some links or whatever, uh, like my Facebooks and stuff. So if you're all looking for me on social media and stuff, y'all can find me. I share a lot of crap. Sometimes I'll do stuff, talk about things sometimes. Um. But yeah, that's about it for me right now. Uh, so, I know I've said it like 10 times, but uh, yeah, I think I'm going to end it now. So, I will uh, I will see y'all, I guess, maybe tomorrow? Let me see. Maybe tomorrow. I think I might make another video tomorrow. Maybe a short video, more to the point. These, these videos here, they're kind of longer because I haven't really talked in a long time. So, kind of... Uh, Subbating y'all on what's going on. But, um, alrighty, guys. Uh, I'm gonna catch y'all later, and, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Woohoo! Thanks, uh, thanks again for watching. And, uh, this is Anthony out. Uh, y'all have a good day.